JT. Good morning, Matt. Yes, this cross is all about the local wildlife. We found one that's only around this time of year. I believe he goes by the name of Easter Bunny. Morning, Easter Bunny. He's being looked after by some of the locals. That's a way to guarantee the Easter eggs make it to your house. <laughs> Looking very good. Okay, from bunnies to crocs. Karana Croc Farm. This is Adam. This is Harley. How did Harley get his name? So uh, we opened a Harley ride shop with a family friend and um, we ended up uh, strapping a, a little crocodile to the handlebars. Looked like he was doing 100 mile an hour and the name's just stuck for the last couple of decades. I tell you what, it must be a beautiful place to take a Harley or a motorbike around. It is a gorgeous place to go for a bit of a ride around here. Um, I'm a dirt bike uh, fanatic, uh, so Byfield, Emu Park, along the beaches, mm. absolutely gorgeous. So we're at Yapoon. This is Yapoon Lagoon, and this is the beautiful Capricorn Coast. And Karana is where you can come and see these beautiful saltwater crocodiles up close and personal. They are magnificent, aren't they? They're like dinosaurs. Oh, mate, they are. They are like dinosaurs. Uh, in fact, they're pretty much older than dinosaurs, but uh, a, a perfect creature, un unchanged, unformed from millions of years. But have you kids ever touched a crocodile? Would you, would you want to come and have a look? What's it like when you touch one? <laughs> have you ever touched a crocodile? Yes. Um, yes. Do you want to come over and give him a little pat? Yeah. Tell us, how does it feel? It feels soft. It does, it feels much softer than you expect, doesn't it? Yeah. Go on, jump in there. Being very polite, letting the girls have a go first. What do you think? Good. Feels <laughs> really nice. Feels really nice. Well, let's have a look at your weather forecast. I mean, in the wild, these crocodiles... They're pretty scary, but it feels like this guy's more like a puppy dog. Yeah, well, he is. I mean, we, we well, I can't say he's a puppy dog, he's a puppy croc. But, <laughs> uh, look, this one here was uh, not doing too well, so we separated him away from the group, and we looked after him, force-fed him, raised him, and, and, look, in the in the time of doing so, they do get accustomised to you, and this fella proper accustomised to us. He's very relaxed, very calm, very chilled out. He's one of the family. Is this, show, us, show us how you were holding him before. Look at this. It's like a little baby being rocked in a cradle. It's very sweet. It's a, it's a very special that relationship. Is Look, he's even opened his eyes up now to say hello. He's in his happy space. He's in his happy space. That's like uh, Lyle, Lyle Crocodile yeah. for anyone who's seen that movie. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, it is, isn't it? So gorgeous. Yeah. Beautiful. Uh, Thank Most you, well JT. looked after crocodile in Queensland, I reckon. Yeah. Thanks, guys. See you back here, Yapoon Lagoon. Say it for yourself. It's fun. We'll see you then. <laughs> Thank you, JT. Well, moving on now, and a warning.